What's going on, everybody? Welcome to G Myers World. And what we're going to be talking about right now is the new NFL replay players, okay? Um, they released Patrick Chung and, uh, what's it, Assimile or whatever, whatever that guy's name is. I don't even know why they wasted their time uh, making graphics for those cards. Because if you're running around with those cards, you're probably an idiot. Um, so let's just leave that to the way that it is and let's go ahead and continue with the video. I'm going to do a couple things right now. We're going to talk about um, overall if these cards are worth it, um, the packs that are available right now. Um, are those things worth it? Um, you're looking at Martellus Bennett and Ahmad Brooks at 92 overall. Pretty much what they do this for is for guys that have budget squads, all right? If you're not looking to go over the top and to, um, you know, continue to build your team to a certain level, this is probably for you. This is probably something that could help you out. So let's go ahead and take a look at the set right now. Um, NFL replay players, right? And the only thing that you have to really focus on about this is to understand that when these things come out, I want you guys to make sure that you understand uh, the solos that we use for, um, uh, what is that, the boss battles. I want you guys to make sure, that, you know, you get a free replays player, right? Let me go, let me check that out real quick to show you what I'm talking about. Because I try to make sure that I address it because for some reason when you guys watch the video, I say exactly what you're supposed to do and then you guys ask the same exact questions. All right? So this is what it is right here. This is the objective list. And this is the way that you get your loyalty tokens. All right? You have to go through, you got to do all these things, win five games, pass for 300 yards in a single game, pass for 1,000 yards combined, rush for 100 yards, rush for 500 yards uh, combined. So this is in one game, and then make 10 field goals, right? This is every week until they release the loyalty uh, set that will be coming out to give you guys probably a free 99 and give you a transferable card into Madden 19, all right? So this is the, um, <clears throat> the, the actual objective list, all right? Now, as far as the cards go, the cards overall have really sucked. Um, for the replay players, I don't really care, including Aaron Rodgers. That guy's awful. All right, so let's take a look at what's going on right here <clears throat> and get to all of the NFL players that go into it. Now, the offensive hero, right? This guy, um, Kilichi Asemele. But Asemele? I don't know how, I don't know exactly how what's going on with it, but it's something like that. Now, these are the cards that go into it. All right, now. Based on everything, okay, hold up, Will Fuller had a really good game. He's supposed to be super fast, right? 36K, what's this guy doing? 95 speed? Yeah, he's not going to burn anyone. And his release is a 82, so they're going to press him right into the ground. That guy's an idiot. All right, so I'm not going to look at whatever. Oh, wait a minute, Tavon Austin? Yeah, he's kind of tiny, but what is his speed looking like? What's his speed looking like? 96? Yeah, it don't matter. What, what's, it, what's his release? What's his release? 79? Yeah, 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 bro. Don't worry, but they're going to hit you with a freaking uh, X-Men glitch, and you're going to be out of the world, bro. You're not going to be on the field anymore. That's how hard they're going to press this idiot. All right, so look, let's not worry about all that, because we ain't coming for all that, all right? So looking at the cards right now, you got Martellus Bennett at tight end at uh, 92 overall. Now, there is absolutely zero reason to spend money on this card, Okay. I don't care that his run block is an 84. I don't care about anything like that. Let me just explain to you why what's you know what's going on. Well, Bo Jackson is a glitch, so don't worry about the comparison with that. Let me just show you this guy right here, right? Rob Grunk, this card, Rob Gronkowski's card is probably the worst card in Madden. This guy sucks. But if you look at this comparable, right? The Hunter Henry that you get from the boss battles, he's a gnat, all that stuff. Yeah, that's great. But you could see why this doesn't make sense for you to spend the money. If unless you're that kind of person that just wants to spend coins and get that card. When you compare them to the other players that are available, it's not really, um, I don't know how to say it. It's not necessary for you to do anything with most of these replay players because realistically, they don't do the things that they say that, you know, that they say that they're supposed to do. So it doesn't really matter. So all in all, you have to go one way or the other. Either you're going to make a budget squad with these cards or... You're going to continue to try to build your team. And in that case, you absolutely do not need this guy as a replay player. All right, let's look at Brian Hoyer's stats because, you know, dude's garbage. You know what I'm saying? Let's see what, okay, 69 speed. Yeah, okay. Oh, they gave him the meta for throw power. Yo, bro, uh, fun fact. That 88 throw power is the same as 95. I'm not sure yet 100% with the 99. I'm going to be trying out Culpepper later. But 88 is 95. I've already tested that. That's still the same thing. I know it's stupid and it makes no sense, but they gave him, at least they gave him the meta for throw power, okay? In case you wanted to run a budget squad for whatever reason and just be a complete idiot, um, that could work out for you. You know what I'm saying? That That's something that's good. As far as Mike Tolbert, what, what is this guy doing? What is he like a, a 70 speed? What, what's this guy doing? Oh, 81 speed with a 92 trucking. That's pretty nice, bro. You can probably run around with him and truck the entire defense of whoever the team is. So overall, these are the players, right? And again, this is budget squad action. 
and just another way to keep you guys busy buying packs until they ultimately release, you know, ultimate tickets, which is uh, cards that we get to design ourselves, or they might have some other things that we don't even know about that's coming. You know what I'm saying? EA, when it's time to get bank, they just start releasing whatever. It doesn't even matter what they're doing. So we have to wait to see exactly how that works out, okay? Now, replay week four defensive hero, Patrick Chung. I'm not trying to hate, but you know what I'm saying, bro? Like, even though I started it off like, well, you know, usually when somebody starts it off with, I'm not trying to hate, they are hating. I don't see the point of having this guy. I'm just, like, he, he probably wouldn't even complete the set. Like, Patrick Chung himself probably wouldn't complete the set. But that's neither here nor there. We ain't coming for all that. This dude right here, Ahmad Brooks, yeah, I, I don't know, bro. Like, you know, you're a 49er fan and you want to spend this kind of money? If, if you If you want to do it, and just be a complete and utter buffoon, you know, you could do it if you want. I, I just don't see why you would do it. Because, look, let me let me just explain something, right? With the way that the zone threshold works and whatever they did to tweak it, a lot of plays get open regardless now. And I'm talking from launch to where we are now. The game has changed maybe four or five times. And usually with other games, when they patch it, they make it better. This has not been the case over the last three years with Madden NFL football, okay? So... Right now, what you're looking at is you have to find a way to be able to get through the gameplays and enjoy it, you know, enjoy it the best you can. So if you're a Pats fan and you, and you like Chung, go ahead, go for it, bro. Look, I'm never going to tell you guys, to not, if you like Manti Teo and Invisible Girlfriends, whatever you like, bro, go ahead and do it. I'm not going to tell you that, you know, yo, bro, you shouldn't, I don't care, it, bro, I don't care about all that. What I want you to do is enjoy it, you know, for the best way you can, because we all go through the same nonsense. All right? So don't feel like, all right, if I want this card, you know, I know he's a bum, whatever. Everybody, most of the cards don't play to what they say that they're supposed to play to. So don't feel like you have to listen to what anybody else is saying. I tell you guys, I urge you, whatever you like, you make that happen. Okay? If you want Patrick Chung and you want to run around like a complete and utter, yo, idiot, you could go ahead and do that. Doesn't matter. He's a 96 overall. He might help with your team, et cetera, et cetera. All right? So I want you guys to understand that. Now, now that we're done with all that NFL stuff and the NFL replay and things like that, and you guys know about your loyalty badges and stuff like that, which is why it's good to have that, because you can actually complete those things within these solos. The only problem with me is I don't currently have a quarterback because I've been rage selling everyone. Um, Aaron Rodgers sold. Okay. Tom Brady sold. Like, bro, and these are 98, 97 overall quarterbacks. This game is doing bad things to my brain. So let me show you exactly what's happening right now, right? What you should be proceeding to do. You should be going to your boss battles, right? Doing these things to unlock the hero a bonus boss battle. What is this for? Complete the this week's heroic boss battle to unlock this challenge. Okay, earn, beat this challenge to earn an additional boss trophy and a 90 overall boss. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, all right? So I didn't even know about that till now we just got in there. All right, so that's pretty good. We'll see what's going on with that. If you guys want me to go through everything, I guess I could probably do this on a um, we could probably do this on a YouTube stream or something like that where I go through everything with it and uh, explain thoroughly what's happening with that. That that looks pretty interesting. All right, so this is what you're gonna do for your actual, you know, to pass for 200 yards, you rush for 500, whatever it is. This is what you're gonna utilize that for. Okay, that's what this is for. Everything else. That's what, you know, you, you, everything else that comes after that, you're not worried about that. You're just trying to get your loyalty badge by completing the objectives and the progress, okay? That's what you're trying to do. So you're going to use the current solos that they have available, and now you know about a bonus solo. So that, that's even more beautiful, you know, for the guys that complete whatever this week and get an additional player, all right? So now that that's all done, now when we look here with the NFL replay players, right, you can buy the packs if you don't... I don't know how you could the combine the combine packs you can make money off of because you know you could do stuff with the tokens you could go ahead um, and put certain players into sets to get combine tokens you could upgrade different champions there's way to make money with that all right by just simply going here and um, you could put an 83 to 80, 88 overall player in there or you can use two combine badges to make players and then you could sell the combine players and obviously people are putting those players in the sets to get warriors and stuff like that, all the other kind of good stuff, right? So you can make money off of the combine uh, promo. I don't know what this replay pro promo is doing right now because the cards have been utter trash. They've been utter trash. They've disgusted me. So whatever way you guys decide to go with it, that's fine. But what I'm going to do for you guys to give you a bonus in addition to everything that we've been doing 
I'm going to go over now. And this is my monthly rewards. Okay. These are my monthly rewards. Um, and I'm going to show you what I get out of them. Just so that we got an idea of what EA does to me. Um, I'm going to open these packs for you guys. All right. So bam. It's just going to be straight garbage. All right. And then after that, at least you guys were able to see it. Because I didn't show you guys the last pack that I opened. Um, just because it's, it's not necessary. It's, it's, it's all garbage. It doesn't. The gold cards are probably going to be useful to you later on. Okay, you might think that that's good, but it's actually not. But I could probably use them in a set, though. What is it? 79 speed, 92 throw power? Okay, 83 throw short. 70, nah, he got a 70, I don't know, 83 throw deep, though? I, I don't know. I don't know how to... But he has conductor, though. We got to see it. We got, but his card is going for, like, 400K. So, you know, I know you might see it to the top left. Oh, it's a 10-time gold pack, so I made out. I really didn't, though. I really didn't. This pack right here. I'm going to see what this guy's going for. But probably, he's probably not going for too much because his actual overall legend is at like uh, 4.99. dollars um, Because all the quarterbacks in the game are garbage. So it doesn't, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't really matter what you do. Um, and and that's, that's my monthly. You know what I'm saying? They gave me a 10 time because I didn't really play a lot of weekend league because I care about my health. So we got two elite players and this is what they gave me. All right? Okay, so you guys are happy. You see what happens? This is what I go through. As much as a lot of you other guys go through. But we can't complain about it. What we got to do is, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to make elite tokens out of this idiot, Ali Marpet. And he might sell for more, though, because he's upgradable, I think. But regardless, I used to rage uncontrollably. But then I realized, he ain't don't care about nobody. They don't really care about us. Bro, Michael Jackson, rest in peace. They don't really care about what's going on. So we have to stop being idiots and thinking that they do. Most of our pack luck is going to be exactly like that. Completely and utterly ridiculous. All right, so don't worry about it too much. Just go ahead. We're going to get through it together. But make sure right now at this point, I could make a lot of gold tokens and do like a lot of come ups. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to wait it out and see what's happening because I believe that they have some other sets that are coming soon. All right, so because they're coming soon, we could probably wait it out a little bit and see how we want to work it. But what's Warren Moon going for? This is what you guys want to do. Even see like it's 45K. So is it worth it for me to sell them right now? Because I'm not going to use them. But maybe somebody else wants to complete the set. And, you know, it probably wouldn't work out if I put them into a, um, into one of the elite token sets. So I'll sell them because I don't really, it's nothing I can really do with them other than sell them right now. So I'll get rid of them. So I'll make 35K from just, you know, playing weekend league and almost dying for the entire month. That's what they gave me. All right. We utilize that the way that it is. Um, Randall Cunningham, it doesn't even make any sense to check his price. The dude's garbage. Ali Marfit, I don't think anybody's still upgrading him right now. Yeah, so he's down. His price used to be very, very, like, a couple months ago, he was up there. But because his price is that low, it makes sense for us to just leave him the way he is, and um, we can make elite tokens. But be careful with the upgradable, um, you know, the upgradable cards. Like, I think he's part of a set. Is he? Let me see something. I, is he? Uh, yeah, he is. Yeah, because I remember I sold him for, like, 60K at one point when I pulled them before earlier in the year. So be careful with those. But for the most part, if it's not like a major name guy with the upgradable situations, they're not going to be worth much. All right? So that's pretty much all I got for you guys right now. You got the NFL players. You got to see my weekly, uh, my weekly, well, my monthly weekend league rewards. And um, that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and get a, view, a video view goal of about 30K. Like, share, subscribe. Leave a comment. Let's talk about some stuff. And I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. G Myers World. One love.